So if you've been following me for a while, you'll have at least heard me rave once or twice about a tool called Descript, which basically what this does is we use this extensively to edit videos because what it will do is it will allow you to edit a video as though it's a Word doc. So I'm just going to, this is a video that I created earlier for my blog, AI Powered Agents, and I'm just going to hit transcribe. So what it does is as soon as I put the video into, into the window, you can see it's already prepared 10% and we can see the video here. Now, pretty soon we will see a transcript. Okay, and so here it is. Now, this is my script. So let's just press play. So it's relatively big news today in in the chat GPT world in the plugin space in that uh, chat GPT is well there's been a plugin in the least for cat. Okay, so we can see that this is not this is not perfect. It could be jazzed up a bit this video. And you can see what Descript has done in that it's underlined all of my filler words. And down here on the timeline, you know, it's done this automatically, but you can see that there are some gaps where I'm thinking about what I'm going to say. And also there's a fairly big snafu here in that, you know, the dogs came in and started parking and stuff. And so really what I want to do is get rid of that and, you know, the video. So basically, you know, I can select this text, which is right up to here where the, you know, where the dog barking happened and just delete this like it's a Word document. And then the second thing that I can do with this that's pretty cool is it's got this thing called magic edit. So number one is I can shorten the word gaps. So every every time here where I've kind of taken a breath, I can just go anything more than one second, I want to short, shorten to half a second. I'm just going to say shorten all. And that is just going to compress this slightly for me, which is excellent. And then the other thing I can do is I can get rid of all these filler words. So I can actually get rid of all my ums and ahs and, you knows and, you know, really, really like double words, things like that. To do that, I just go remove filler words and it highlights them all. And then I can selectively say some filler words. So I could go, I only want you to remove ums, ahs, and I guess, you know, so there's that and let's just go remove all. And you can see that it's just taken out all of those. I mean, I might get, you know, I might take I mean and you know out as well. So let's just have a look at those. Uh, let's do that again. Oh, not short and word gaps. Nope. We want to do remove filler words. And this time we want to get rid of I guess, but we wanted to go get rid of if you know what I mean. It's, I mean, I mean, I guess not great language there, but, uh, yeah, I don't want to get rid of repeated words automatically like this because it might take this out, which is actually pivotal to the video. So I'm just going to go removal and now that's all done too. And so now I've got a pretty well finished video. So it's a pretty big news in the chat GPT world today in that Plugin with to release, I think, one worth the. Now, there's one more thing I can do with this because I'm not entirely happy with this sound. And Descript has this thing called Studio Sound. So, what I can do is I can turn that on, and Studio Sound will take out the things like the dogs barking in the background and a few other bits and pieces, make me sound like I've got a really nice microphone, even though I'm just talking into an iMac at the moment. So while that's processing, it shouldn't take too long. And now we should be about done. So let's play this again. So some pretty big news in the Chad GPT world today in that plugin was released, I think, or yesterday or today for Canva, which brings the power of Chad GPT prompting to Canva, allegedly. I haven't tested it. Yeah, so that you can hear definitely that the sound is a whole lot better. I am just slightly worried, though, that we've deleted a word there that we probably shouldn't have. So if that's the case, we can actually just go back and edit that there. So I'm just going to move that along and just see, because it thinks that's a filler word. Well, today in that our plugin was released. Yeah. 
And so there we go. There's my video pretty much done, except now I'm going to publish directly to YouTube from, from the script. So from here, I can kind of say access private public unlisted, sign into YouTube and boom, the video straight up there. So that they're just some of that, that's just scratching the surface of Descript. But if, if you're recording videos and you really want to clean things up quickly, I mean, this has been less than five minutes to do this. So uh, I highly, highly, highly recommend checking out Descript.